Hi, I'm Anne-Marie and I'm an Associate Transport Engineer here at Abley. I uh, have worked here for nine and a half years. I'm Jeanette, I'm a Technical Director here at Abley. I joined the company uh, a couple of years after Anne-Marie and I think one of the reasons I actually came to Abley was because I knew that there were other women here and a lot of young people. I did my engineering degree at the University of Canterbury and then worked in New Zealand for a couple of years and then went to my OE of course as all New Zealanders do. Came back to settle in Christchurch and worked at Abley. Um, a few years after that I had a child and took a year off and it was really up to me to decide when to come back and how much to come back for and in my situation I came back full time to really kick start my career again and then um, went back into part time so that I could juggle home life with work life. I'd had a long term goal of um, competing in the coast to coast and I realised that to achieve that I couldn't work um, full time. I reduced my hours and that has provided me that flexibility to train for that. I ended up dragging Anne-Marie on this journey as well and we both completed the Coast to Coast this year. Yeah, the, the flexibility I think is a really unique part of being at Abley's. I've had a number of different roles um, in terms of managing people and more recently I've decided to um, focus a little bit more on the technical aspects. It's all about you know helping the younger ones through mentoring and training and also being able to focus on technical work. And in addition to the external training courses that we send people on, we also have a program of internal training and I've had the opportunity to develop and present those internal training courses. The culture is very inclusive, um, in particular when we look at the gender balance within the transport team, um, we, we are probably close to 50-50. It's particularly um, useful for the likes of Anne-Marie and I to be role models to those younger ladies coming through and essentially mentor them through and there's a, a concern I guess overall in engineering that there's very few women in leadership roles but actually it's not just about management roles or you know managing staff, it's actually the technical leadership and that's where Anne-Marie and I have had a great opportunity to, to lead our staff um, in a non-managerial way and that's something that we both really enjoy and just recently Anne-Marie's had the opportunity to be on the governing board of the company. Yeah so I've just recently become a director on the board and that's a new challenge for me but I hope that I can bring um, a different perspective to the board in terms of um, both being a woman and also having experience in the industry and um, hopefully it's early days yet, but we'll see where that leads.